Good morning class, this is for level two blueprint reading and uh, we have a new assignment. It's dimensioning orthographic and pictorial drawings. So we're going to be taking known dimensions and calculating the unknown dimensions using simple math techniques of addition and subtraction. We're going to also be using fractions. So we're going to start out with navigating Schoology to get to where we need to be. So if you look here, let's go to level two. Go down to blueprint reading. Now, <clears throat> additional resources is where the print will be located. All right, so mechanical drawing 58 PDF. Go ahead and do that. Now, to get a better view of this, what you want to do is scroll down here and then open it up as a document. All right, now you get a much better view, no clutter. So what we're doing is here is the drawing we're primarily going to look at. These are the drawings we're going to reference. So if you look here, you can see all the lettered signs for dimensions. A is they want to know what this dimension is here, from this point to that point. B is what is this dimension here. Now the task at hand is to reference the known, established, and posted dimensions on one of the other three views. So naturally, and you'll see this is common, this view here is the front view. You should label it front right across here so you don't lose your reference. This is the top view, and this is the right side view. This is going to be common throughout this entire exercise. So if you look here, you have established and posted measurements. See where it says four and three quarter. Okay, so this plane here, or this face here, is title A. You need to find what the measurement is for A and post it right there. So by looking here, you can see there is no measurements in the top view, but there are measurements in the front view and the side view. So for this example, A, you look at this face and find out is that measurement somewhere here located? And it is right there four and three quarter. You can see it. So this is the A measurement and you would post that right here. Now to look at the B measurement it's right here. Now will you be able to see the B measurement from the front view? No. You actually have to look at another view for the B measurement. Well obviously it's not going to be on the top view it must be on the side view. So you look here, and this is already posted as two inches. So that would go right here in B. And that's how you try and decipher how to find these measurements. These measurements must be located on common blueprints throughout your entire career. So this is the exercise to get you used to it. How to take an orthographic view and calculate pictorial views into establishing dimensions. And that's how we're going to do it. All right. Now I'm also going to do a uh, hint or a helper in coloring. Now some of you have done this in class already and what we'll do is we'll shut this video off and I'll show you how to color these views so it helps you reference where they're located just a little bit better. Thank you very much.